Let's jump right in. I wanted my app to function like this. I give it a prompt, and it generates a YouTube video similar to this one. A land humming with forgotten brilliance. We know of sophisticated metallurgy or Damascus steel secret might have originated here. The objective is simple, but the implementation is not. I realized I needed at least four modules to achieve this. Module 1. Content Generation The main goal of this project is to minimize user input. Instead of a prompt, the user only needs to enter the topic they're interested in. The AI would then find good titles and content for it. To accomplish this, I use Gemini. Send the topic and request title generation. The user can choose one or regenerate new titles if needed. Next, I ask Gemini to generate content, which the user can finalize as described earlier. Module 2. Text to Speech Luckily, I already use this functionality on this channel. I leverage Tortoise TTS, similar to Eleven Labs and other advanced AI tools. However, it's open source and free to use locally. Tortoise provides an API endpoint for quick speech generation. However, there were some challenges. Speech complexity increases with text length, as the model needs to understand the entire context before generating speech accordingly. I faced this on my own channel. To address this, I developed an algorithm that splits the text into smaller, meaningful parts. This ensures high-quality audio while efficiently speeding up the process. Besides audio, we need two additional elements, text and corresponding timing. This allows displaying text in the video at appropriate moments. Image prompts. We use Gemini again to identify keywords from the generated text and store them as image prompts. Module 3. Image Generation Running an image generation AI model locally would be time-consuming. Initially, I considered Perchance AI, which offers free AI image generation without login. It worked well initially, but after some time it flagged me as a bot, and I could no longer generate images. After some searching, I found pollination. This AI allows you to generate images using a simple GET request. That's it. Just send the prompts as requests and save the corresponding images. Module 4. Putting it all together. The final challenge was combining everything with proper synchronization. I used the Movie Pi library in Python, a video editing library perfect for this application. I added some effects to the text and images to improve the look. After several adjustments, I achieved a satisfactory result. Now let's see the results. I posted these on a different channel with zero subscribers, while these shorts weren't top notch. Surprisingly, they got more views than those I created myself. Now let's consider the processing time for the whole process. Content generation is the fastest, taking less than 10 seconds. Text to speech takes around five minutes to generate a one minute speech. Image generation takes seven to nine seconds per image. A one minute video might typically contain around 20 images, so that's 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Video creation itself is currently not very complex and takes roughly the same time as the video length, so 1 minute. In total, the process takes approximately 8 minutes and 40 seconds. Let's say a user requests regenerations and makes some corrections. It would then take around 10 minutes to create one video. Let me know in the comments if you'd like a video explaining the code in detail. Thank you for watching.